Let me turn to the controversy over Hillary Clinton's emails. You just heard John Carr report this House Speaker John Boehner poised to announce a new investigation. Do you expect a new investigation in the Senate as well? I don't know what will happen in the Senate. I do think this is uh, reminiscent, just as the panel you had on was, of what the Clinton years were like. One of my favorite commentators last week said uh, the Clintons could find a loophole and a stop sign. And uh, I, I think we're reminded of what it's like when, in spite of what Mr. Carville says, the rules that apply to them, they clearly don't think are the rules that should apply to everybody else. How do you respond, though, to critics who say that it's, it, it's kind of rich for Congress to call for these investigations, to, to level criticism like that, when Congress exempts itself from the very reporting requirements that it imposes on other federal officials? Well, the obligations of Congress here are different than the obligations for the Secretary of State. In fact, the obligations for Secretary of State uh, to have a record, to maintain that record, to know what that record was, uh, are critical because that person is a critical negotiator, just like John Kerry is. But uh, go back to the other point, they're a critical negotiator, but there is a constitutional process here that you have to go through.